This is Dakota News Now Sports. Though March Madness is reserved for basketball, February's madness is on the wrestling mats. The South Dakota State dual tournaments last week crowned Sturgis and Canton team champions, and this week's regional tournaments will send hundreds of wrestlers across the state to next week's traditional meet at the Premier Center in Sioux Falls. The Region 2A tournament held today at Brandon Valley High School. All our action in the semifinals, 150 pounds. Yankton's Chase Platt folding Brandon Valley's Xavier McGuire over and getting the count and pin at 321. One mat over at a buck 65. Harrisburg's Logan O'Connor, a runner up at state last year, has Vermillion's Patrick Fulton in a headlock. And he gets the mat slap to finish via the fall just 53 seconds into his match on the way to a region championship. Tiger teammate Dylan Johnson at a buck 57, not so lucky. Beersford Alcester Hudson's. Robert Watkins has him locked up tight and pinned at 238 to advance to the championship. 175 pounds, Washington's Lane Knutson has Yankton's Corbin Saylor hooked by the leg and the head, ending that match at 129. He'd go on to win the title in a 4-0 decision. 215 pounds, take a picture because it didn't last long. Vermillion's Raleigh French rolling Yankton's Peyton Eustace over and pinning him at 140. Raleigh took the Region 2A title as well. Finally, very familiar last names for the home fans. 190 pounds, Brandon Valley's Elijah Shunky takes care of Harrisburg's Brody Sonnenshine in 235, followed moments later at heavyweight by his older brother, four-time state champion Navarro Shunky. He needed just 19 seconds to take care of Lincoln's Braden Peterson. Each brother taking home individual region titles, and their Brandon Valley squad captures the Region 2A team title by about 16 points over runner-up Harrisburg. All region tournaments are tomorrow.